underway. That's why we're just waiting for you to get in the spectator stance. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Okay, we're good to go. And Texas, please stop streaming Pac-Man. I'm begging you. There better not be another robot clip. Man, I swear. Okay, I'm all caught up now, which is nice. Uh... Right, so Grishendo off to an early lead. <clears throat> He's well known for uh, having quite an aggressive play style. Grishendo is. He's good at. He knows his game plan is all about uh, weaving in and out, pressuring the opponent's shield, and then retreating, and then immediately going right back to pressuring. And it's working out very well for him today. Mm -hmm, for sure. Oh wow. oh wow. Something is wrong with my stream. Something is definitely happening. Killing it, then going live again. There's an error while decoding the video. Oops. <laughs> yeah. Should be fixed now. But, uh, Crescendo definitely taking a huge lead. Um, Roy obviously able to pressure as well, but Wolf does have that blaster to keep going check if needed. Yeah, for sure. Oh, nice little upbeat. Tendency breaker from Crescendo. Wolf is just so good. Almost getting that Both kill with that upbeat. Both of these characters are, honestly. Yeah. Nice back air trades with the Roy up air. Crescendo takes. Crescendo pulls ahead here in this game. But uh, Crescendo definitely taking a good lead over. Uh, uh, thick. Over, uh, he's thick. playing. He's playing thick. Yeah. I know. I, I was looking at the tag. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Yeah, Luke, Luke, Luke already beat Fuji. Yeah. So, uh, but Crescendo just making, taking this lead to like the max. He's being so precise, just weaving in and out. Making it very hard for- Oh, he went for the flash, but, <laughs> but Thick just got uh, to his death because he couldn't have made it back. So Crescendo gets the two stock in game number one. There you go. Really, okay. uh, That was really quick. Yeah, oh, very convincing game number one. I think he's uh, definitely comfortable in this matchup. But I mean, yeah, only two Vic, is an Vic is an accomplished player. He's been doing very well in, the, in Manitoba's Wi-Fi Weekly. So I am sure that the uh, the course of game the, the game number one will not dictate the the course of the entire set. I think this is going to be a fun one. Yeah, for sure. Let's see how uh, Thick can change it up. Yes. Do we have any online? Weeklies in SK? I don't think we no. do. No. No. No, I haven't. I haven't. This is the first tournament that I've organized since July. Mm, gotcha. And I have no plans of doing one again anytime soon. This was good. You know, one last hurrah before yeah. the end of the year. Maybe over Christmas I'll run a couple. Okay. Sounds good. But uh, switching up with Robin. Uh, Interesting. Not sure I, feel about this pick. I was under the impression that his secondary was Cloud, but uh, yeah, I guess he has a Robin too. This is interesting. Maybe this is just meant to be. Uh, uh, it's meant to. Uh, <clears throat> what am I trying to say? It's meant to be sort of a really weird niche pick to mm. fluster Crescendo or, or maybe uh, confuse him in some way. That'd be my guess. And I'm saying that because. Bentatek, who is uh, in the chat right now, has done that to me before, and it's worked very well. Okay. 
but uh, it doesn't seem that crescendo. Or Pink is working on crescendo. He seems yeah, I feel like I feel like Wolf Wolf is so good against Robin. He just has the uh, he has the aerial pressure and the the mobility to be able to to weave his way through Robin's traps and setups. Yeah. Setup characters don't do well when their opponent doesn't give them time to set up. Mm -hmm, so, sure. yeah, this yeah. is going to be this is very problematic for for Fuji. But he's uh he's not out of this yet. He's got ninety five percent, and uh, Robin's kill power is extremely admirable. Oh, especially with that Levin Sword for sure. Yes, but he's lost the Levin Sword for now, so he might have to look for an Arc Fire or something. Yeah. Back throw has very high base knockback, but not a lot of knockback growth, so that won't start killing for a while. Down smash again from Crescendo. Three stocks to one. Jeez, Crescendo is like, I am proving myself here. He gets hit by that Levin up air, but uh, yeah, he's saying, you know, your, <laughs> your weird pick is not gonna, it's not gonna Yeah, it's not gonna work on me. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, yeah but landing near him, so the Crescendo's conversions have been very clean so far in the set. Mm -hmm. He goes for another up B, but uh, Fake is able to grab that. Catches the double jump with the Nair, but he trades with Wolf Nair, and so uh, he wasn't able to extend his advantage state. He has to flash. Okay, roll behind back throw. <laughs> Crescendo going wild. Really nice conversion. He gets the soft flash into the up smash. And that is a 2 0 lead. Yeah, for Crescendo. Yeah, that wasn't even a true combo. But uh, God, that's insane. Wolf's just so good. I'm curious if, um, yeah, that wasn't a very smart choice on a uh, thick side. Robin just does not do well against Wolf. I imagine we'd probably see a cloud. And apparently, some of the Manitoba guys have oh, said yeah. never seen a Musa Looks like before. Like So, oh, I'm he's just leaving. leaving. He's leaving for one second. Oh, All right, okay. so we have a bit of a delay. But right now, we have... Uh, Endo. Albert, Saskatchewan. Up 2-0 on Thick, Manitoba player, who uh, appears to try me and Roy, Cloud, and uh, Robin. Perhaps just has a Robin secondary. Okay. So, uh, Thick is doing something. I'm gonna go grab some yeah, water. He's, he's back he's now. Back. But yeah, go, yeah, go. go ahead. Wow, wow. 42 wow. viewers. It's pretty solid. This will be the last the game, game the, or the last, the last set. set. That takes place on my stream because we're gonna get into top eight afterwards. We're gonna do that on Savage Stevo's stream, and Dilf and I are gonna be commentating that. So yeah, it's gonna be exciting. We'll probably take a take a ten or fifteen minute break to get all that set up after this set ends. But uh, thank you everybody for tuning in and watching for so long. This tournament has actually run at a, a relatively decent pace. I was worried that we'd be here till eleven or twelve tonight. Oh, Thick is gone again.
<clears throat> All right. So we're going to get a third character in three games from Thick. He's going Cloud. Oh, Possibly now we're seeing the Cloud. Hopefully this Cloud can uh, get some work in. Yeah, he's going to need... Uh, He's gonna need all the help he can get, and that up he had a shield to start off the game is gonna be uh, perhaps a bit of a confidence booster. And I know Crescendo actually has a cloud as well, so so he we'll have has. to see if there's some we'll have to see if there's some familiarity that he shows throughout mm -hmm. this game. One of the things is that cloud does slightly outrange uh, Wolf with especially that back here. Yes. So hopefully can you put that to good work, but Crescendo is just going in. Yeah, we're still seeing Crescendo control the pace right now. Despite the fact that uh, Thick has limit. Oh, he gets the footstool. <laughs> he tries to go for footstool and then tech chase up the really creative stuff that we're seeing from Crescendo right now. Another upbeat. It's getting to the point where it's almost not a tendency breaker. It'd be a tendency breaker for him to not go for that upbeat. But nonetheless, we get the back air. And this game is looking rather similar to the first two, despite the character switch. Let's see if Let's Thick see if can, can, uh, uh, can find something. God. Got an awkward moment here where uh, I appear to have disconnected from the, the lobby here. Hopefully it was, it was me and there. Oh no, it was Thick. Thick disconnected. There it is. Uh, okay. Almost made it through the tournament with that one. Yeah. yeah. Sorry about that, guys. That's not exactly what you want to see when you're watching a Wi-Fi tournament stream, but it's always what you're going to see, because it's Wi-Fi. So... What do we do now? Yeah, Thick is saying in the Smash GG chat that his uh, Wi-Fi is acting up. Okay, so I think that's a GG. I think that is as well. Yeah. So it's actually, in, in terms of the rules, it's actually percent, Crescendo's call on what happens next. They can either reset with uh, even stocks or play game three over again, or Crescendo can take the win. So we're just awaiting a decision from him in the Smash GG chat. He's saying let's run it back. So we're going to do game three again. Okay. It'll be nice on Crescendo to uh, probably do one. He doesn't want an easy win like that. He wants to definitely Yeah, for sure. That's a respectable play. So, we so yeah, we are going to get game three, two, imminently. And perhaps that uh, stock in a bit was all that uh, was all that Thick needed to be able to download, to complete the download on Crescendo's Wolf and bring the set back with the cloud. Yeah, we'll see. Ben says we're currently uh, speaking in a cave. Sorry, I'm just gonna rip off the I swear to God. Hold on a Hold second. On a second. Okay, good. Three, two, one, go! All right, here we go. Here we go. Going back in. Uh, hopefully, hopefully that reset of the uh, the commentary stream is a bit better. Yeah, for sure. I hope. Yeah. Yeah. So, fairly even game. Fairly even start to game three two. That wolf nair actually uh, was able to outprioritize cross slash limit cross slash. That's a bit crazy to me. But uh, Shenda will certainly take it. That was a bit of a precarious situation for him. He goes for the wolf flash, and all that all that uh, Thick can get is a, a, a weak hit of dash attack. Yeah, and that dash attack did get My goodness, that dash, dash attack go. is going to kill, though, at 104%. So, uh, oh, he gets the up smash to catch the, the jump, the full off. 
It's uh, a big apparently, in stocks. Apparently there's a echo from the commentator. Echo? Echo. Okay. Well, well, if there are commentary issues, this is probably the last game of the of the broadcast, so yeah, it won't be for too much longer. Then we'll go to Savage Devo's stream, which is a uh, much better quality than mine. And I'll be done. But uh, yeah. Thick doing a lot better of a job uh, keeping up with Crescendo now. He really is. Yeah, he gets that dash attack, and that's gonna kill. And he takes a slight lead in game number three. Yeah, that's been a problem that we've been having in uh, in some capacity all day, actually. I went back and watched and listened to some of the VODs from Pools, and there is a bit of an echo the whole time, but it's still, I think it's still watchable. Okay. So Crescendo gets that GIMP. Actually, I don't even want to call it a GIMP when it's at 153%, but whatever you want to call it, it results in an even stock match. He catches the double jump, and he gets the sp Oh, he doesn't get the spike. Oh, apparently it's coming from my computer? How's it coming from my computer? Seems like you're not wearing headphones. Hmm. I am wearing headphones. So am I. Hold on one second. Thick takes game number three after some technical difficulties. And I mean, you have to wonder, if Thick comes back to win this set, is Crescendo going to uh, regret his decision of not taking the win? I don't want to speak too soon, but it's got to be weighing on his mind. Uh, I don't think it's me, because I don't commentate with my headphones. I actually have a microphone, so I don't know what it is. Yeah. I'll, I'll watch back. And see what it was. Yeah, for sure. We'll take. We'll we'll see. But uh, it's a temporary issue because top eight won't be on our stream. Okay. So yeah. Game number four on PS2. I'd be quite surprised if they pulls a reverse three L after a disconnect. I'd be quite surprised. But uh, let's see what happens. Let's see what they if they can uh, keep this momentum up. Early lead from Crescendo, but it's quickly uh, evaporated by that back air and a cross slash from Thick. Cloud doesn't have a lot of combos, but he just does a lot of damage when he gets this. Yes, hit. yes, he does. Pretty even game. Crescendo gets that nair to catch the jump out of shield, a dash attack, and he's going for a, he's going for these strange options, despite the fact that. Uh, you know, Fixed Cloud is looking to be more, uh, a lot more capable in this matchup than the first two characters he tried. They're a bit of a lazy flash on stage, and uh, this Cloud is honestly looking to be just what the Doctor ordered for yeah. Thick right now. Mm. I think definitely after that game, after that game one, should have went to Cloud right away aside from instead of that Robin. Yeah. Oh, he gets a limit, which allows him to make it back. Yeah, you can't uh, can't challenge that downward uh, the downward anvil of uh, climb hazard out of shield. He tried to Crescendo tried to up smash it and just took damage for it. Yeah, for sure. And uh, yeah, I think Cloud is definitely working a lot better. Oh, nice! You got the sour spot flash into up tilt. That's the overcast. And uh, he's at quite the deficit here, but it is even stocks. Thankfully, uh, Wolf does deal a lot of damage and also has really good combos, so... For sure. Yeah, I, he could definitely That's a good combo right there. He gets 47% off of that, but extends a bit too far with the F-Tilt and takes a climb hazard out of shield for it. Dash attack into up air. Wolf dash attack into up air at mid-percents is not a true combo, but it always seems to connect, probably because there are no better options that the opponent has. Again, Crescendo goes for it. Uh, a ballsy flash on shield, and eats a dash attack for it. It's probably just a really tight timing. Back here to catch the jump. 
He gets an F-tilt to catch the air dodge. Thick still has a jump, I believe. No, he doesn't. So Crescendo gets a gimp, and it's only a 22% deficit now. Oh, really? Yes. Now it's a 1% deficit. <laughs> Thick kind of spam and dash attack there, but it eventually worked out. Caught, uh, got Crescendo off stage and dealt about 45% to him. Down throw dash attack. Can he get a tech chase? Gets another dash attack. Thick is off stage, but Crescendo lets him get back to center stage. Doesn't try to ledge trap. Burns his cross slash really early. And, uh, this is a very close game. Very close, yeah. Crescendo goes, gets a dash attack, tries to go for an up air, but uh, wisely pulls back. I think he uh, would have gotten punished if he had committed any further. Back throw to send Thick off stage. He gets the Nair. I think that caught Thick's jump. It did. So Crescendo clutches out game four very close. The cloud was definitely game from Thick, but ultimately Crescendo was too much to handle. 3-1 for Crescendo over, over Thick, and that'll get him into top eight. Sure. Yeah. Congratulations to Crescendo, making it out to top eight, being another one of the SK guys. How about that? We got, in our top eight, we have four Manitoba and four Saskatchewan. How very fitting. Very fitting. It is. All right, so that is going to be the end of the Squire stream. Thank you so much to everybody for tuning in. Hop on over to Savage Stevo stream, twitch.tv slash SavageStevo1 for top eight. It will begin imminently. And uh, that'll be it for me. Uh...